carbon emissions from the use of fossil fuels is causing the biggest challenge we have ever seen in the human history. Climate change, it already started causing many natural disasters, taking away many forms of life. So the whole world is rushing to find clean sources of energy to replace the carbon intensive petroleum. Now you will be happy to hear that there is a smart solution in the forest. If we could sustainably harvest at least 10% of the wood we have and process them to biofuels, we could potentially replace the entire petroleum products we are using today. Bioethanol is one major form of biofuel which could be used to replace the gas in our cars. Now, how do we produce ethanol from wood? Well, if we have simple sugars, we can directly ferment into ethanol. However, these sugars are present as complex polymers in wood. What I mean by complex polymer is long chain of sugars, which is very hard to break down. Apart from these sugar polymers, there is another component called lignin, which glues the sugar polymers together in a very tight, complex matrix. Now, our job is to liberate simple sugars from this matrix. This breakdown process consists of two stages. The first one is a chemical process, and the second one is an enzymatic process. The chemical process releases some of the simple sugars in water, leaving a solid which consists of rest of the sugar polymers and lignin. Now, the enzymatic process breaks down most of this rest of the sugar polymers into simple sugars. The major economic challenge for the viability of wood to ethanol process is the large amount of expensive enzyme used for this process. The likely reason for this large amount of enzyme is the presence of lignin. Because in my research, when I completely remove lignin, I can get high sugar yield using very, very low amount of enzymes. Now, complete removal of lignin is also very expensive. So in my PhD thesis, I'm looking at what lignin does during the enzymatic breakdown of complex sugars into simple sugars, and how we can modify lignin economically so that we can enhance sugar yield using very low amount of enzymes. So, at the end of my PhD, I hope to contribute to the development of world bioethanol industry. As you know, the Stone Age did not end due to the lack of stones. Let us hope that biofuels will make an end to the oil era even before we run out of oil. If you could do that, the generations to come will be really thankful to us for keeping this plant clean and beautiful. Thank you. <laughs>